Welcome back. Okay, we saw the Miller Bucks go down in heartbreaking fashion. Will the Senton Pirates in state quarterfinal action as well? Let's head over to the San Antonio area. Southwest Legacy Stadium as the Pirates took on fifth ranked Wimberley. They had already dispatched of two of our Coastal Bend teams. Orange Grove and Ingleside here in the first seven nothing Wimberley. Cody Stover in for the score. Texans going up 14 nothing after the first quarter, but Senton coming back here in the second. Tristan Hansen going to find Jacoby James and for the score cuts the lead in half at 14 to 7. But now later it's 17 7 Wimberley and a big strike from the Texans here. Stover going to hit Noah Birdsong. He is gone 60 yards to the house. Wimberley goes up 24 to 7. Coach Michael Troutman oh, not very happy. Wants his guys to stay home on those. Not allowed the big score going into the break, but Sinton not going away before the half here. Pirates driving down the field and they get in with under a minute to go. Hansen and for the score, two point no good. So that cut it to 24 13. Wimberley at the break, but second half, all Texans. Wimberley starting to pull away here when Stover rips off a long touchdown run. The Texans outscore Sinton final 14 nothing in the second half 38 13 the final in this one. Brandon Schaff was over there in the San Antonio area caught up with coach Troutman after the fourth round defeat. Well it hurts. Um, you hurt for these players. You hurt for these seniors. You know um, the reality of it there's only there's only one team that goes home happy um, at the end of the season and that's the state champion. It never gets easier and um, you hate to see them. Um, um, because it means um, so much to him. You hate to see them, um, how, how, how bad it hurts for him, you know. Ah, so that means football season has come to an end in the Coastal